Hey guys, I'm Nick from Active Chiropractic and I'm going to show you how to do massage for your hamstrings using a lacrosse ball or you can even use a tennis ball, a cricket ball or even a practice hockey ball uh, depending what's at your disposal really. The hamstring muscles are all composed of semitendinosus, semimembranosus and bicep femoris. Now these muscles are attached from the hip bone across into the knee joint. It helps flex the knee and also extend the hip. The reason why we would want to massage the hamstring is because due to tight hamstrings from immobility, from past surgeries, past injuries even, or just vigorous exercise, for example running or um, bodybuilding, weightlifting, powerlifting, a lot of squats even, or even postural issues that your chiropractor has detected. The first thing you can do with, uh, to break up the adhesions is use a firm bench, put the ball between the bench and your leg and work from the top bit here and just roll it from side to side. The muscles are actually attached from the outside of the leg, behind the leg and also in the medial side. So by putting this in, you're actually running this, those, those muscle fibers across from the ball and breaking the adhesions up. You might feel a bit of discomfort, and, but it will break up over time. Then you just go and move down slowly as well. To add more pressure, put your hands on top and lean forward and roll forward like so. And I actually can feel the pain from here and also in my knee because it's referring pain. So I got a few active trigger points there. Now the second type of massage is myofascial release. So you find if if you're not trained to find the trigger point, just find the sore area like so with your fingers and then place the ball there. Press down on it a little bit more heavier. Now I could find that quite painful already. Push down and then slowly kick forward. To me that's really painful. And you'll do about six to eight reps of this. Do it nice and slow, and that's about it. So I'm not suggesting that doing these massages will actually solve the issue of pain, for example, that you might feel in your thigh, in your knee, in your leg, in your back, or even in your buttock. So it's best that you see a professional such as myself or a chiropractor to assess the issue and diagnose the problem properly because there could be a lot of issues for example osteoarthritis in the joint a subluxated joint sciatica like a lot of people might speak about or even other muscles muscles that are tense thanks for watching guys remember to like comment and share my video if you have any ideas of things that you might like me to do a video on just comment below and i'll add it on the list of things that i might want to do so have a good day